Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you what User Maven's website analytics module is all about and how it can help you track your website visitors, traffic and how you can get meaningful insights out of it. For this demo, we have one of our own products, contentideas.io, which is basically a free tool for finding trending content on the web. And you can see the stats here. Uh, first of all, you can see visitors, like how many new visitors uh, and how many returning visitors are we receiving on a daily basis. How many page views are we getting on a daily basis? How many sessions are being initiated? As you can see here that some of the data is missing here because this feature, basically the sessions uh, were introduced on August 31st. And uh, similarly, you can see visit duration. You can see bounce rate. You can see events. Uh, events are basically any actions being performed on contentideas.io. And these are automatically tracked by user maven you don't need to involve your developer uh, for any action uh, or any event tracking and uh, we also show these graphs in uh, line format as well so you can switch between bar graph or line graph according to your preferences and we also have time period here so you can select time period according to your needs uh, and compare traffic between different time periods Another important thing to notice here is that you can install user maven's tracking pixel on the subdomains of your main website as well. So for example, if we have blog.contentideas.io or uh, maybe app.contentideas.io, you can also install the tracking pixel there and then you can easily filter stats for each of those domains. Now let's see what else we have got here. You can see top sources to find out which sources are basically bringing in traffic to your website. You can switch between sites, you can see search engines, you can see which social networks are bringing in the traffic, and you can also see the top pages that are being viewed on your website. You can also see which are the entry pages on your website, and what are the pages where users exit from your website. Moving forward, we have data about devices, operating systems, and screen sizes as well. This can help you in optimizing your experience according to your users' devices. Then we have locations here to see where your traffic is basically coming from. You can see it in the map format or you can see which cities your traffic is coming from. And if you are using UTM tags on your external links, then you can easily identify which of those external links are bringing in traffic to your website. These are pretty helpful for analyzing paid campaigns because if you use UTM tags with your paid ads on Facebook, Google or any other traffic source, you can easily see which of those sources or campaigns are bringing in the most value to you. Here you can switch between source, UTM campaign, UTM medium, UTM terms and UTM content. Moreover, we have events auto capture here. You can see there are lots of events that are being automatically captured by user maven and you don't need to involve any developers to capture every action performed on your website. Also, you can send custom events. For example, if there is any event that is not on the front end and it comes from the back end, then you can ask your developer to send it in the custom events field. And you can also track conversion goals in user maven. So for example, if you want to see how many people viewed the pricing page or how many people signed up, how many people registered or how many people performed any specific action on your website, you can easily create a conversion goal and measure the conversion rate of it. As an example, we have created three conversion goals here according to the important functions performed on this demo website. Another cool feature that is coming up soon is uh, the Google keywords. Basically, the keywords that are being used by users to search your website and once they find it on Google and click to land on your website, you would be able to see those keywords here as well. We will have this feature by integrating it with Google Search Console. And finally, the most important feature is that you can also track funnels here. So you can create as many funnels as you want, add as many steps as you want, and you can track where users are basically dropping off uh, on any of the steps to optimize the experience of your website and improve your conversion rate. And setting up funnels is pretty easy in user maven. So basically, uh, there are only two things that you need to set up, which is conversion goals and funnels. 
everything else that you see here is automatically captured and shown on this dashboard one of another cool features that we have recently added is sharing your dashboard so what this feature does is that you can create a publicly shareable link and you can add password to it so that you can share it with your clients or your marketing teams or anyone else and they would be basically able to view a replica of this dashboard without even logging in another important feature that i would like to highlight here is that if you click on any of the items for example if i want to see or filter traffic by a specific location for example usa you can see that filter is applied here and all of the stats are being filtered by this attribute that we selected here so you can see all of the stats are filtered and shown by country usa but that's it for now uh, we would love to know more about how you are planning to use user maven and if you have any specific features that you would like us to add in user maven we are looking forward to your feedback thank you